hello guys and this is another chess video okay this is um a lesson in the perils of being greedy i've done this before and i'm doing it again okay now you will notice if you look that um the black knight um on the um column where the two queens are is going to play a prominent role in this okay you'll also notice there's a bishop next to um the knight let's go back a bit right so my move was to move the um, bishop out on the surface it seems fairly innocuous unless you look very carefully okay one of the things that i was thinking of doing was um moving the knight so that it would take either the queen or the rook but i had an even better idea i thought that if i could somehow get um my opponent to move the black knight it would be checkmate but they wouldn't realize it so i'd rather hope that they would move the black knight and even though i didn't ask them to even though it could have taken a while to do it and even though i had an idea by later moving um, a knight to threaten it um basically um they decided to do it all by themselves. So here goes. This is what happened next. They then moved a pawn forward. They, I think, were trying to um, basically do something rather devious so that they could try and um, threaten my um, queen. Or make me move the queen or make me just anyway their idea was to try and somehow maybe trap me in some ways that they could perhaps um, take a pawn and hope somehow to make it a queen how I don't know but anyway it's irrelevant right the next thing I did was take the pawn now they thought they were being very 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 clever they decided to move the knight and get me to check this is a forking check okay and by that it's a check whereby um after um they've got me in check they can take a piece while i could in theory take the knight off I would lose the queen by with the queen i would lose the queen by doing it because then the um queen would be taken off with the bishop okay however they did exactly what i wanted and they did exactly what i hoped they would do and i hoped they would fall for the bait and take the rook so this is what i did i just seemed to innocently move the king out the way it looked innocuous um they couldn't believe their luck a, 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 a rook for a knight without even losing the knight at this point they probably were very pleased that they'd managed to take um the rook what they didn't notice was that now the um column with the queen on is opened up okay so now my queen is threatening an entire column so what you might think well you probably think well if it wanted to it could now do a quick they could now do a queen exchange later because i'm a rock down or i could then um do something similar i could move the knight to threaten the queen and the rook so that it would have a choice between saving the queen or the rook 
or maybe doing a queen exchange but no what I'm going to do is even more devastating than that I'm not even going to try to take the queen or the rook off at all instead I'm going to take a pawn and the pawn is the last thing I take off in the game checkmate They lost the game because they were greedy and they wanted to take a rook. Okay, so that's a lesson in greediness, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.